Alright, hello and welcome back. In the last episode, in case you missed it, Sir Galif valiantly took on a knight where he was promptly eaten and rescued by our very own Carmelita. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Vanquishing him a knight in a slide game. Seems like I'm very much on theme. Either way, we do have a mission up with Murray, short supply. Let's just jump into it. Can you make that jump? You, he almost did. You know what? I'll give it to him. A five-ton hippo almost made a very... Not very long jump, but I mean, he is a freaking hippo after all. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, listen up! We need to hit the Black Knight where it hurts! And that means taking down the operations he set up in the village shops. First up, Murray, you'll need to visit the tavern. Sorry, big guy, no time for snacks. The tavern has been converted into a fuel production facility for those robotic guards. Get in there and do what you do best. Tear the place apart. Next, Sly, you'll need to revisit the shoemakers. We're going to shut down the machines fabricating those ginormous parts. Last but certainly not least, Galif, you'll need to infiltrate the bakery. My instrument readings show it's the main power source for the other production facilities. You're the only one who can reach the second floor where I believe you'll find a generator. There's no time to waste, so let's get going. A generator in many years. Okay, you heard Bentley. Very interesting. Together, we can bring this whole operation down. Yeah! Let's go kick some butt! Murray, you need to get to the tavern. I think for this one, you should go right through the front door. You mean like nice. punch through the door? I meant walk, actually. Well, uh, I like to have options. Of course, when I'm playing with Murray, I see like five different people that have, uh, goodies. Do I have any powers for Murray? Gloved punch. So, no. Just default. Murray, you need to shut down the mixing system. Try disabling those vats. I got you, chum! The Murray is gonna rain destruction like a cloud of pain! Interesting analogy. Murray, try throwing the cards into the vat! How... How is this a kid's game at this point? This is some truly diabolical stuff right here. Go over here. Do -do 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 -do. Keep going, Murray! I just murdered a man. Go over here. Wait. Do it. Nice shot, Murray. Go over here. Outstanding, Murray. Two more to go. The Murray is a terrifying cyclone of devastation. The Murray is a psychopath. Dude, stop playing Ring Around the Rose with me. Get, get over here. Yeah, just one more, Murray. Hey, this is pretty good cardio. Nope. Ah, oh, barnacles, I missed. Do, 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 do. Get in it, Murray! The Murray is triumphant! Shutting down a small business 
to help a aristocrat. I don't know how I feel about that. Do you have money? You do. Go over here. I have infinite smoke bombs, so... What? How do you see me? I put a smoke bomb down. Do you have a ghillies? You do. Damn. Usually I would try to rob them, but we're on a mission. Does literal like light fireballs don't destroy this, but a freaking laser bolt does. I mean, and now probably could have shot that a little earlier, but that's fine. Do, 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 Oh, I was not paying attention at all. I saw something shiny. A random rope there. Where is the... There it is. Bullseye. Maybe next time that we can invent some laser-proof rope. Take over from here, Sly. Whatever happens to that technique we learned. Ah, this one. Not my favorite, but. Ah, barnacles. I forgot about the movement. Almost missed that. Come on, Bentley, stay on target. Jeez, it's like a pinball machine in here. I need that. Thank you. Danger. Uh, come on. Think this is end? Yeah. Was exactly the same as the freaking Ratchet and Clank one from future tools. Way to go, Bentley. This place is definitely closed for business. Ropes can easily be cut by lasers. This is literally the first time a rope was cut by a laser. Okay, Gallus, you need to get inside the bakery. If we shut it down, we can bring the Black Knight's operations to a halt. Fear not! I will smite the source of this plague that corrupts this land. Uh, let's just start with the bakery's power source. Treasure. I was wondering what the hell's up here. I am the Dark Knight. Look at those amazing surroundings. The horizon is truly beautiful. Bentley. 
Oh, there it is. This is... Oh, man. A little trippy. Alright, this is it. You'll need to shut down those three sub-generators to disable the central device. But be careful. I suspect the system has an auto-reset, and you'll need to deactivate them all before that happens. Enough twaddle and gobbledygook. Time for action! Oh, boy. <laughs> this is how uh, people end up missing limbs, bro. I don't want to listen to the genius. Keep going, Gallop. You need to shut them all down before they restart. Fear not. Sir Gallop will triumph. Uh, maybe. That's one more. Get it before they turn back on. Time to end this wickedness. Oh. What sort of infernal magic is this? Oh wow, it restarts if I get hit by a laser. That's not cool. It has to be lasers. Ah, oh, you cheeky bastard. Don't touch the lasers! It'll reset the system! Really, Bentley, I hadn't been aware of that. Turtle soup, I swear, one of these days, mate. Cutscene saved my life. Remarkable work! You did it, Gallop! We smashed the Black Knight's operation! Gallop the Gallop. Gallop. Shell shocked heart. I feel like that term has fallen on the favor, my friend. And we're robbing him first. Yep, didn't even notice me. Come on. What is this? A scroll? Oh. Dude, if you were broke, you should have just told me. The audacity of people when I'm trying to rob them and not having any money. Again? Usually I'll let them live, but when they're wasting my time like that, I have to end their existence. Ooh, I don't know what that was. Alright, this dude looks like he's loaded. He has a crossbow. He has to have money. Turns out I was incorrect. Can I get up here? Yes, I can. Okay, controller, stop acting weird. Okay, we're gonna pretend like that didn't happen. Hurry up, Slowpoke. Whatever, just don't lose him, Sly. I mean, he is literally a turtle. Hmm. It looks like the production facilities in town are down. I'll have to look into that. I have a feeling Cooper has something to do with this. Your feelings are quite accurate. Giving me a headache. He makes me so mad. I need to squash him once and for all. Then I can get things back on track. 
the hell did I ever do to you? Well, I mean, I did destroy some of your facilities, but... One little facility? Warrants my death? Materialistic, man. Very materialistic. After I crush the Cooper gang, I'll put them all in the circus. Maybe even shrink that fan of theirs down and turn it into a clown car. How fun. Huh. My balloon surveillance system is malfunctioning. It's probably those darn birds again. I need to invent a scarecrow with a rocket launcher. <laughs> a scarecrow with a rocket launcher. Bentley, he's going into the blacksmith shop. Should I follow him inside? Now, I'll take it from here, Sly. I should be able to get inside through that hatch on the roof. Time to get some answers. Interesting. Imagine this Penelope. That'd be freaking awesome. I mean, she was the Black Baron. Huh. She was the Black Baron. I wonder if... No, probably not. Will it make any sense for her to go back in time just to mess with Sly's family? Rats, I can't hear anything from up here. I'll have to get closer without being seen. I can turn those laser fields off with my darts. Okay. I better stay up here in the rafters. I can't risk being seen. Decisions, decisions. So Should I feed Cooper to the dragon? Or make him into a rug? Maybe I'll feed him to the dragon first. Then make him into a rug with the leftovers. Ha ha ha. Interesting. No way I'm letting this guy get his hands on slide. How the hell? Does that dude uh, not hear explosives really around him? I should add a refrigerator to this armor, or at least some kind of cooler. Friends, it gets so thirsty walking in this thing. Blasted Cooper gang! They may have shut down operations for the time being, but I'll have the last laugh. My castle is impenetrable. Once Operation Overlord is complete, I will be unstoppable. Oh, I'll penetrate the hell out of your castle, bro. Operation Overlord? I don't like the sound of that. World War II, here we go. Commencing hack. Which one is this? Hey, this is my favorite one. What? This is the what the one that bounces off the walls? Yeah, Ricochet. Ricochet. The one that bounces off the walls. Alright, that's the one that you have to go around. Dude, can you uh, piss off, please? Thank you. Alright, let's try again. Drifting! We are the tank boy. I bet a laser loop around multiple switches would do the trick. Oh, I have the switch. First, we gotta take care of uh, these tanks real quick. Alright, tanks are destroyed. You. Can you guys, for the love of all that is holy, piss off? Thank you. Oh, you bastards. Oh, so close. Good, good. All right. Let's try this again. Or 
There we go. Where's my turtle? Ah, oh, there it is. Oh, wait. <laughs> uh, ought to do the trick. I am indeed a silly goose. I'm curious as to why um, Bentley's the one doing this. Can I make it? Barely. And not Sly, considering all the jumping around. Where is that stinking La Paradox when I need his help? He owes me everything for stealing Bentley's time machine plans. Bentley? Oh, Penelope, what a little fool you were. Okay, I was right then. Oh, no. My plans? That means... I caused all this? Penelope! Oh, please, Penelope, be all right! I swear on my mother's shell, I will crush you myself, Black Knight! Do you, do you really not see it? Time for a binary beatdown! Dude, Penelope is the Black Knight. I think. I'm pretty confident she is. Alright, I are a bit acquired. Break, I say break. My dude has guns akimbo. What's going on? Terrifying that the machine just said my name, but whatever. Get this bomb. Cool. I've never been more convinced of a char character than the Black Baron. Than the Black Knight, I should say. It's been out of it. Barnacles. They gave me every weapon imaginable. They couldn't give me like one shield. Weird design, Bentley. Weird design. Bentley is the man, all caps. Same guy? Yeah, this. Prepare to be reformatted. What the hell hit me? Weird. What am I? No 
wonder your processing stinks. The bombs are so much faster. It's funny, they give you all these levels, but realistically, you could just destroy this dude with three bombs. You don't even need to get the level done. I have to keep that in mind for the future. Oh! Most didn't make it. Blast it! One of those guards leaked oil all over my clean floors. Why is it so hard to find good help? You do invent a robotic. Oh, oh wrong button. <laughs> Looks like someone's AI routines are not the stuff. You really don't see it, Bumbley? Dude, you're supposed to be a genius. You made a time machine. How did I miss? Wait, did I miss? When this business with Cooper is over, I need to take a vacation. Some place where I can get a fruit on the umbrella. Somewhere tropical with no robots. Yeah, vacation! I gotta make sure the only place this guy's going is straight to prison. Um Wait what? Uh game? Whatever. Ah, oh, there it is. And the other one's right there. Thing. It's not possible! Phew, that thing's almost as stuffy as Bentley. Penelope? Uh, but why would she... If only Bentley hadn't been brainwashed by Cooper's honorable thief nonsense, we could have made billions in weapon design, the two most brilliant minds on the planet working together. We could have owned the world! But no matter. Once Cooper's out of the way, he'll see things my way. Poor Bentley. He's kind of cute when he's being dumb. Damn. Uh, I think I'm going to be sick. Kick her to the curb, bro. There's always somebody better out when there. When Bentley returned to the hideout, he crawled into his shell and wouldn't come out. Nobody could blame him. Penelope may have betrayed our friendship and trust, but she betrayed Bentley's heart. I knew he blamed himself for the whole predicament, but it wasn't his fault. Everyone took turns trying to coax him out, but nothing worked. In the end, it seemed that Bentley would have to come back to us on his own. Unfortunately, we couldn't wait around. We had a villain to take down, with or without Bentley's help. And this time, it was personal. I can't believe that she betrayed Bentley. Evil, evil person right there. Either way, we are going to end episode here. In the next one, we will continue to take down the Black Knight. She should have at least change her name. As always, if you do like the episode, if you do like the series, make sure you hit like and subscribe. Great way to support the channel. Great way to help it grow. And I will check you out next time.